thank you, Carrie Booney, for joining us today. It's just a wonderful opportunity to really highlight the wonderful and rich culture and cooperation uh, between and among the American people, and in this case, the film industry, and uh, what's a wonderful and dynamic uh, opportunity and festival here that has a rich history of bringing forward uh, some terrific uh, films and practices and trainings and workshops and indeed our grant uh, working with the Zanzibar International Film Festival is going to really focus on formalizing our relationship uh, and being able to bring in some very special American experts in the field of film. Uh, we'll bring in Judd Ehrlich who is an Emmy Award winning um, a uh, film expert uh, for having won the Emmy in 2015, as well as Deborah Zimmerman. She's an American film expert who focuses through her NGO and particularly on women filmmakers and trying to help build the skills and opportunities and connectivity for uh, women uh, filmmakers from uh, Zanzibar and the region. I think uh, the workshops we're looking forward to doing are going to really focus on uh, promoting and training for documentary filmmaking and the marketing of distributions of films and for the first time it's a workshop we're gonna have that's dedicated for the first time ever dedicated specifically to women yeah right and to women who make movies here and to help uh, help them uh, move ahead the partnerships will are going to include a screening of Judd Ehrlich's new documentary film called the keepers of the game it's a it's a very well-known documentary they're gonna have Swahili subtitles at the film festival this year and uh, they're also going to play in local communities and villages in Pemba and in Guja. The Keepers of the Game, as some of you may know, follows a Native American girls high school lacrosse team as they sought uh, to become victorious and move forward in, an, in a sectional championship in a field in which uh, uh, men or boys were really heralded. So they broke a lot of uh, new ground in focusing on the role of women in sports through this documentary. Uh, we're going to enjoy some cultural exchanges, uh, dialogues, and debates. Uh, so I just think it's a really fun and dynamic project. We're so looking forward to working with you and the ZIF. Um, and I do think this really underscores such a the, the rich diversity of cooperation and collaboration uh, and heart that we, the American people, share with the people of Tanzania and Zanzibar. And we really look forward to um, continuing to work in that field as well as the other fields that we do in Zanzibar focused on health and other projects. So uh, it's great to support a non-government organization uh, like yours and to see what's going to be a wonderful festival that brings in thousands and thousands of tourists every year and is so well renowned. So thank you for letting us be part of this and we're so excited for the summer. Yes, okay, thank you very much. <clears throat> Karibu, and thank you very much. I think uh, your intervention uh, this occasion, this opportunity to organize a workshop, but also to screen films. Mm -hmm. And I have to remind, I mean, ZIF has received this year nearly 600 films wow. for submission. And uh, we have to cut down to 100. And uh, among them, they are not only keeper of the games, about more, at least five, six, seven uh, American films, more. Then we will have uh, the Ivory Game, which is very important film mm -hmm. produced by Leonardo DiCaprio as well. So it's a very American presence in our <laughs> festival and we're very glad. And I think I said, what is it's really interesting is that you come in and in a moment which is very important for ZIF, it's the celebration of 20 years. Mm -hmm. And you come in in this moment, which is a kind of uh, gift to our birthday as well. And, and it's a moment, it's a, it will be an addition very particular because not only we have films, not only we have your presence and, and, and the workshops are very important. As you said, we are, we've been always uh, underlining the, 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 the role of women in filmmaking and culture as a real protagonist. But this year we will want to make a step forward. But in those uh, workshops we will have Mr. Dexter Davis, who is from this street uh, company from America, from New York, I think. And he will come in within uh, the workshops, helping filmmakers, especially from East Africa, to boost their films, to how to market, how mm -hmm. to pitch a film. And, and uh, talking to him in Berlin, uh, 
He's a producer of a film, special uh, of uh, Afro-American films, and he's he's also the producer of the film Kumeni, who opened here in Dar es Salaam, and he will be there. And he was telling me the next big step in cinema will be Africa. Mm -hmm. He really believes that the big step in, in 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 world cinema will be Africa. So we are very proud of celebrating that. And to and I conclude, uh, we will be for the first time two major events in CIF. One is a competition for film school. We believe that everything starts in a film school. And we, we want to uh, really support the young filmmakers, men and women, who try to enter into that kind of industry. And so we will have, we had a, like 70 films uh, submission for film school. So we'll have this first competition for film schools. And second big thing, uh, we will open the first ever market for film and television. So the, the circle is closed. The beginning, the school, in the middle we have the filmmaking and the mm -hmm. professional. At the end is how we sell our film. And, and uh, we will have, we had in, uh, uh, many, many companies who are already applying from especially Kenya, Uganda, and so on, and we are waiting also the Tanzanian. And it will be a market concentrated on East Africa. So and I hope that uh, your embassy will be also with, with us in that three days, which will be the first business uh, gathering that ever mm -hmm. for ZIF. So thank you very much.